Good morning, everybody. Today is the day. I'm so excited. Today's the day we bring home our puppy, our golden retriever puppy. I'm so excited. It's um, 7.33 right now. We're going to meet them in Wenatchee to get a little pup, and that's about a three-hour drive. Um, so we're gonna have some breakfast, have some coffee, and then get on the road in a little while, probably like an hour. Um, but yeah, I'm so excited. This is, I like could barely sleep last night. I kept waking up and being like, oh, wow. Oh, wow, okay, so let's go get a puppy. Make sure to subscribe and I hope you're excited as I am right now. Do you feel, do you feel the excitement? Okay, I'm gonna make some coffees. This is my abstract art. Beautiful, huh? Are you excited? It's puppy day. <laughs> he just can't stand himself. He's so excited. Grace is here, everyone. I have a little snow dust on my. Grace is here. Grace. We're leaving the house now, starting our three hour road trip. We're going to get the puppy. Oh, is that a video? It's yeah. Blurry, though, We're going dog. to get the puppy. Yay! Road trip. That lighting, though, makes us look like we look good. Ghosty. Hey. to get Henry and we had to go through Steven's we pass an and literally it's snowing so much that everyone and their mother decided to come up today <laughs> and so I was holding my bladder for so long and it was so full that it was the most painful peeing experience I've ever had. You can hear a CG. <laughs> so we had to pull we to do on the side of the mountain and this is Grace. <laughs> All this the pee. Grace? This is Are my this is my pee. This is turning into a full-blown adventure to get the puppy. <laughs> it happens to be like the most snowy day we've had. It's supposed to have 38 inches tonight yeah, of snow. In the past, yeah. In the past, and we're going through the pass right now, and it's just dumping snow, and we're gonna be late. We left early, but we're still running behind just because it was stop and go all the way up the mountain, basically, so. But look at how snowy. It's like very winter, winter wonderland for sure. Looks really pretty though. For sure. For sure, dude. So he just said he's not snowboarding. Yeah. <laughs> Kinda. Kinda. We all are born again after we got to pee. Everything is going swell. Puppy parents. I'm so excited. I'm so excited. Sage is hungry. This drive has been absolutely gorgeous the whole way. Like, look at that. That's insanely beautiful.
That's Roro. Isn't that just the cutest little thing? We are already loving Henry so much. He's been such a good little boy. And Rohini has just been the world's best dog mom. It's insane. Where is he? Oh, a family outing. That's the cutest little thing I've ever seen. Oh, adorable. Okay, I think that's all the update we have so far. Things... <laughs> Why is this so funny? <laughs> Things are going well, and that's about it. <laughs> we got Henry home. We got Henry home. He's having some dinner. He already got comfy in his crate. He had some water. Oh, he already went out a couple times. Hi, buddy. Hi, buddy. Such a good boy. Such a good boy. He's so cute. You're getting them all riled up. Ow! <laughs> <laughs> Henry! Oh my god! Henry. This retriever has my. my <laughs> oh my goodness! Henry! Henry! He did. <laughs> you are crazy! You're gonna go off the couch, you're gonna fall again. <laughs> oh. <laughs> what you doing, buddy? a puppy um it is now tuesday we got henry on saturday so we've had him for three days i guess three full days 
oh boy it has been such a journey <laughs> um i think i underestimated a little bit how much how much work it was like i knew it was going to be a lot of work but he just needs constant supervision and if i don't know like i'm so glad i'm so glad my friend grace is here because she's been helping so much <laughs> she's right there but she's been helping so much and like i feel like i would have been way more overwhelmed if i was by myself because like you can't i can't do the dishes or clean or anything at the beginning now he's gotten a little more adjusted to everything anyway i should back up so yeah we brought him home on saturday there was this crazy snowstorm we had to go over the pass so that was like super intense but it made it quite the adventure to go get him and um we got home he didn't have any accidents on the ride home he was super good and he adjusted pretty well he was pretty comfortable with us right away and then the first night we've been crate training him the first night he um woke up like three times during the night to go out during the crate or in the crate and i was really really tired the next day um but last night and the night before he slept all the way through the night in his crate which is like he's the best little boy ever he's the goodest boy um so yeah he's been sleeping from like 10 to 6 30 which is when sage wakes up and i've been getting up then too earlier than I normally would, but as long as I'm getting a full night's sleep, that's fine with me. Um, he's eating super well. He's all adjusted to everything. He goes out. He like still has some accidents, but it's just because you literally have to take him out every like half an hour. And sometimes I get the signs mixed up if he's like whimpering because he needs to go out or because he wants to play or because he's bored or because he's hungry or like, you know, it's just hard to tell. But for the most part, he does go outside. <laughs> um what else we took him to the vet today it's his first vet appointment and um she said he was doing really well he she was really impressed with the the breeder because they give a bunch of information about his like genetic testing and their certified american kennel club breeder and they've already microchipped him and started him on dewormer and they're really good breeders so i don't want to hear any shit in the comments because i've gotten enough already and I'm over it because I am just over it, so. <laughs> I know I'm gonna get more comments. I've, uh, we rescued Blue. We wanna rescue again in the future, but for our family right now, getting a puppy, a brand new baby puppy, was what worked best for us. And obviously, if you rescue animals, that's amazing. And not all breeders are bad. I was getting a lot of shit for it, and people are making these blanket statements, but that's just not true. Like, it's just not true ask a vet ask anyone who works at a shelter i had people from shelters damning me telling me that all a lot of the shit i was getting was unwarranted because people just are so anyway research your breed obviously if you want to rescue a dog that's amazing and that's a great thing to do and they need loving homes just make sure you do your research on your breeders and that solves a lot of the problems because it's backyard breeders who are the ones that get a bad rap anyway back to my update we got um henry from denzel's goldens and they're a really really amazing 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 breeder they're like the nicest couple they give you weekly updates with photos and you facetime the puppies and they treat them so well and they are like top notch doing research about their health and um yeah they're just they're really good they're in eastern washington they're really far away so they met us in wenatchee which is why we had to drive um over there because it was like in the middle i don't know he's just the goodest boy he's so cute he likes to play a lot he has a lot of toys i kind of spoiled him a little bit um but he also sleeps a lot he's sleeping right now he'll sleep like anywhere like yesterday we haven't really left the house that much but yesterday we went on our first outing and um we tried to walk him to this bakery, but he didn't make it. He was too tired, so we just ended up holding him the whole way. And then we wanted to go to the nursery. He was too tired, so we just we ended up driving to the beach and just staying in the car and reading. And then Henry fell asleep like on the the console in between the seats, like completely flopped out with his butt on the the parking or the gear shift. It was really cute. He's adorable. Everyone's obsessed with him. Wherever we go, he gets like a million pets and everyone's like, Ugh. which is what I did whenever I saw a puppy before. But yeah, he's just the cutest thing. I can't even believe he's real. He's just too cute. He's like 
very social and he likes meeting people and he's not very shy at all and he likes to cuddle he's just the best guy and i'm so glad he's crate trained or getting there like i'm so glad he sleeps through the night because that's huge he feels comfortable in his crate and i put on um white noise on repeat on my um phone and then he just he whines for like a little bit and then he knocks out and he sleeps all the way through the night i put his um, bed in there and the breeder gave us a blanket that has his mom and like litter mate smell on it so we put that blanket in there so he feels comfortable and puts his toys and he's fine till the morning it's been an adjustment for sure um i feel a lot less productive with everything else just because he like takes so much focus because he'll eat random stuff if i'm not paying attention um we tried putting him in the we have like a playpen back here which is fine and i'm de definitely gonna have to use that more once grace leaves but um, he doesn't love it, he whines in there, so I haven't been putting him in there that much unless I really need to. I don't know, he's just a great, a great boy, and we love him. We just we love just him, love so, him much. so much. He's the fastest boy ever. Yeah. Um, I don't know, I think he's kind of learned how to sit with a tree. If I say sit and hold up a tree, he sits, so that's cool. Day three. Day three. Eight weeks old. I know, no big deal, he's just a freaking champ. All over. <laughs> That? Uh, I don't know. <laughs> that. Oh. Come here. <laughs> yeah, he's learning his name for sure. Like, yeah. He's screaming loud enough. He's very smart. Um, we're, we signed him up for puppy, like, kindergarten training classes. So that starts on Thursday. It's just once a week for an hour. And they practice, like, um, sit and stay and no biting and all that good stuff. We're going to Ahimsa dog training, if any of you guys around here and he meets a bunch of other puppies there too which is good for socialization that's it it's snowing right now it's been snowing so he's been playing in the snow which is cute so that's everything it's the puppy update i hope you guys enjoy the cute footage of henry because i definitely do and there's plenty more of henry to come on this channel thanks for watching guys don't forget to subscribe follow me on the gram to see lots of cute pics and videos of henry and i'll see you guys soon bye